Hello. Some tricky driving conditions to encounter over the next 12 to 18 hours. The bitterly cold weather stays with us and we've got some snow to encounter as well. So much so that the Met Office has issued a red warning. That's the highest tier of warnings that we can possibly uh, issue. That means be prepared to take action and that is for South Wales. And the reason for that is because this area of cloud and rain will start to move into the southwest. As it bumps into bitterly cold air, it turns increasingly to snow. And on top of that, we'll have strong southeasterly winds, so there's going to be some significant drifting for South Wales. We've also got other warnings out. I'll come on to that in just a moment. But certainly by 8 o'clock on Friday morning, it's going to be rain across Cornwall here, slightly milder air, snow into East Devon, further along that south coast and for the bulk of Wales. We could see 25 to 30 centimetres of snowfall across the tops of the mountains in southern Wales and that's where the drifting and the problems may well occur. We'll also see a mixture of rain, sleet and snow turning increasingly to snow across Northern Ireland through the morning and into the afternoon. As for Scotland, first thing in the morning it's going to be a cold, breezy but bright affair. Quite quiet the weather here and you will see perhaps the best of the weather escaping from the bulk of the snow showers. The same too for the north of England. East Anglia and the London area starts off dry but it's not expected to last and please bear that in mind if you uh, work in London you're going to be travelling first thing in the morning it might not be any issues but there could be some considerable delays for your journey home into the afternoon and evening because the snow continues to track its way north and east through the middle of the morning and clearing up into East Anglia during the afternoon pretty much grinds to a halt across with North East England the same time we see some snow showers drifting in off the North Sea coast as well blizzard conditions are likely and it is going to be particularly tedious out on those roads cold where the snow lies at around five degrees and some rain down to the southwest now these are the warnings we've got out then we've got the red warning for south wales but we've got amber warnings for northern ireland wales central and southern england that means be prepared for some disruption as well so we are looking at some fairly widespread snowy conditions first thing and throughout the day stay tuned to your bbc local radio stations for more updates as we move into the weekend, it stays cold. Frost and ice will certainly be a problem, but the snow will ease away, particularly into Sunday. So more details can always be found online. Until then, whatever you do, do take care.